Hey everyone! Welcome back to some more Let's Play Tales of Iron. In the last episode, we managed to fight through the Mole Arena and afford some cake, which allowed us to distract some guards to gain to go downstairs and acquire some petrol, so we could take a automobile back up here to the Rat uh, or Mouse Kingdom, and here. We're seeing what looks like our castle ready to receive another frog attack. So to that end, let's prepare for that. We'll go ahead and craft... Actually, I guess we should craft the stuff first. And then go ahead and equip any good froggy we have in preparation for a fight. Probably against... I'm guessing it's going to be... Uh, Greenwort. Hey, brother. All right, let's craft these recipes. Another sword. Less damage, more weight. Looks like a harpoon. One-handed spear, I'm guessing. Less weight. Same damage as a current spear or weapon. We'll equip it. A pistol. More range damage than our current bow does, and slightly less weight, but we have no ammo for it. So we're just going to store it. A crown! Less weight, less defense. We'll equip it temporarily. Another cool looking helmet, more defense, more weight. A cool looking hat. Less weight, less defense. Frog armor. This is what I was hoping to see. Look at that frog resistance. Holy crap. A tiny bit more defense overall as well. We'll use this. Oh, I like the look of that armor too. But it's not frog armor, and I suspect we're fighting frogs soon. So we'll just store this. Whenever I start playing the game, it, my joystick is uh, a bit eager <laughs> to run in the game. I don't like running ins inside my castle. All right, let's see. So let's first off get rid of these exclamation marks. And okay, how is this comparative? More defense. This is the best crown. Interesting. Even this purple crown is better than the blue one is. Less weight and more defense. I guess we'll wear this one at the moment, then. Oh, we still have some other gear to get, to get rid of the exclamation marks on. I guess while we're here, let's look at our other frog armor that we have. Do we have any other, like, frog armor? Oh, I like our current armor better. I like all that frog resistance. Oh, hold on. We had some purple frog armor, though. This armor we're currently wearing is better than that one. No, it, it, is, is that the one we're wearing? No, we're wearing some medium armor now. One-handed weapons. I, mean, I do like the look of the swords very much, but the spears is just... It's just better. Less weight, more damage. I can't think of why we shouldn't use it. And that might allow us... That might allow us to get away with using a better two-handed weapon. Oh, we're still using the axe! I think that's one of the best two-handed weapons we have currently. Wow, look at all the weight we could drop by equipping the katana, which does the same amount of damage as our current one-handed weapon. No, let's look with the axe. All right. Nothing new on the quest board. I think the captain of the militia or guard let us know that we should go to our throne room.
The enemy had returned, just as he'd feared, but sooner than he'd have believed. They'd slithered in through a broken pipe in the crypts. His brother and the rat guard had driven them back, for now. His brother Dennis pointed the way. He'd meet them below at the broken pipe. Together, they would end the frog scourge for good. His new mole friend offered to stay and help Comrade Reggie with this fight. If the Rat Kingdom fell, Mole Town would surely follow. All right, let's do this. At least I didn't break in through the cellar down below. And just take the castle a second time. So it sounds like this, the village is once again under heavy attack. If not, oh, everyone's already been slaughtered therein. I really liked our wolf friend. God, I hope he plays his music again. I really like that little tune he played. Oh God, we're fighting! He died as he lived. From the score of frog kind. The guard captain had truly earned his place. In tomb alongside kings. Good god, just getting the snot kicked out of me. Not a good first effort. The same, this is the same enemy we fought the very first time, I think, too, isn't it? We're absolutely at least going to get some of our arrows back. And also, at least we didn't lose. Time as well, it's not, it doesn't look like it's a slaughter. Oh, though, maybe this happened last time too when the frogs attacked. We were we were knocked out earlier, so we didn't get to witness the actual battle which took place. Oh, messed that up badly. Oh, wow. supposed to go down below. Let's do it. I, I, I guess while we're here, we can kill the optional boss that I passed on the last time. And we can deliver that one statue that we bought in Mole Town. Oh, although I, I suppose we should actually go to this to the Longtail Village as soon as possible to try to lift the siege, assuming that they're also under heavy attack. In the King's absence, the builders had repaired the crypt entrance. Reggie was as glad of this sight as he was it had not cost him any gold. <laughs> I'm curious, do we get free gun ammo if we have a shotgun equipped from this? We do! 
Okay, well I can't think of why that we shouldn't use the the shotgun. That's more like a flintlock. We'll we'll use this look at, of it. Um or do I do I stick with the bow? I like all the ammo that the bow has, even if the gun does more damage. We'll wait till we get the best uh, gun unlock. I like seeing these guys now as normal enemies. It it uh, reminds us that the very first one of these we killed was so difficult for us because we were unskilled and didn't have the gear we currently have. Sorry, bug. Our friend isn't playing music, unfortunately. Difficult. They have a more hit points than the last team is had that we killed. <laughs> Woo! Tough fight. Thank goodness for all the frog resistance. We would be probably have died at least once to these battles already without it. Seems like they've cleared out all the undead as well. We're not fighting any of them any longer down here. At least not yet. Dennis was waiting, just as he said he would, and called out to his brother. No doubt that was how they found him so fast. The frog scum. Toxic smoke was too thick to follow, but Reggie's mole friend told him there was hope. In Station 24-7, they sold a breathing device that would let him pass through the smoke unharmed. The king could go in Jay's automobile. Jay would stay and kill any frogs that came this way or die trying. A strange, toxic world lay ahead. Reggie hoped he was prepared. So the 
I guess the quickest way back to the castle, then, is back the way we came. We can explore the rest of the crypts later, then. The king was impressed by his brave mole friend. After the war, he hoped to know him and his strange people better. Oh. Although it sounds like there won't be an end to the war if what we had seen in the introduction is as accurate. The frogs and uh, rats have always been fighting. suppose we should... No, we'll keep our frog armor on. Just in case the frogs have made an excursion into the Mole Kingdom. The Molsheviks, right? That's, that's what they call themselves. <laughs> we like the term comrade, too. That's pretty, that's pretty cute. Well done. Nice. They managed to repulse these rats, too. Oh! I see. We use this to get back to the Mole Kingdom. And I guess it's assumed that we use the mobile here to do so. Yep. Alright, back to Mole Town. I guess Jay must have let Reggie practice driving it. Or it's a, it automatically goes back. Alright, so the only place I can think of... Yeah, is again by the arena. So we may have to fight in the arena again in order to earn some more coins. We have nine coins. I doubt it's just going to cost nine coins. All right, kiosk. How much is it costing me today? 25 coins. So we do not have the money. So that means we're fighting in the arena again. Three new enemies. We just need to kill two of them. Or maybe just one. Is it 25? No, we need, we need two. Okay. So, I guess we're going back in the arena. We might as well wear the best mole gear we've got. So, I don't really like the look of it, but it's... I mean, it's, it's good mole resistance, so... Oh, is it heavy armor? No. I thought we bought mole armor. Oh, here it is. I hate the look of it. But it, but it is fitting, I guess, for an arena. I guess we keep everything else the same. We'll take some more defense. Last time we were here, we got badly... Actually, we wore, we wore a different helmet last time we were here, if I recall correctly, didn't we? I think we did. This war fight in the arena and not use it. It's yeah. Let's do it. Let's, let's go with this. All right. So we gotta fight. We gotta kill either these two or this guy and still another one. So we might as well take on the Molberg. This mole's all about the defense. I'm 
Oh, we got an axe to deal with that. The Molberg shield was thick and heavy, crafted from the strongest plate metal. Getting past it would not be easy. Just slightly uh, too far away. I had to learn to block with the, 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 that attack. Oh, come on, Tim. Hit. I keep trying to dodge away at that. Mm. I'm dead, aren't I? Good for him. All right. Rat, Rat Kingdom Falls. <laughs> Let's try that again. The Molberg shield was thick and heavy, crafted from the strongest plate metal. Getting past it would not be easy. Sorry, no, no talking, I have to concentrate this time. sure what he's going to do when he gets up. Yep, you, ha you have to do the, the big charge. For slow targets. Slow targets make easy gold. That was that's not the case at all, Garrett. G Geralt, that's not the case at all. <laughs> that, that is really difficult. And he wasn't slow. He was really freaking quick. Holy crap, that's an amazing shield. But it's I don't want to go up to medium weight. So we're just storing that. Thankfully, we still have to pay to drink bug juice. We'll do 
absolutely grab some poison while we're here. Save the game. All right, let's do one more. All right, we still have the coins. 25 for that mask. Hulk Mulgan. <laughs> Hulk Hogan. The legendary champion of the arena. He's even gotten a bandana. That's pretty amazing. Let's kill him. The arena champion, Hulk Mulgan, was a living legend of Moltown. His legend would have to live on without him. Ooh, that was lucky. What kind of bad for you, sir? I mean, oh God, what the heck? hit oh man wow he is definitely much difficult more difficult in his second form Finish him! Finish him! Please finish him! <laughs> the arena champion, King Demolition. They cheered. One legend had died, but another had come to take its place. Woo! First try, too. My goodness. My goodness, we had all those arrows we could fill them with. That feels a bit like cheating. It. Ooh, some more anti-frog armor. This will wear. At least at the moment. I th actually, I think I like the look of our other frog armor better. Let's go take a look at it again. So, we got all the cash we should need. Let's go ahead and purchase that mask. The device made it hard to breathe, and a battle helm was more comfortable. But this protected him in a different way, from toxic smoke. With this, he would find his brother. All right. Well, let's first get back there. All right, so I like the look of the other armor better than that one. Armor. Is it medium armor for our other frog set? It must have been medium armor. This was it. It's better than this one anyway. Well, arguably. A little, little more weight, but more frog resistance and slightly more defense. So we'll equip that. That is an amazing shield. our light shield at the moment, I think. Right, and then the sword was not better either. Slightly less damage. I do really like the look of it, though. I love the look of, of these gladius-like swords. We'll, we'll use this one after all, instead of the spear. I know it's a mistake, but I'm, I'm gonna do it. That's the best axe you currently have, Tim. Can 
Can we maybe slip in a medium shield then? Okay, we'll try this for a change. I mean, can we maybe swap to the gun? We can swap to the gun, and we're still barely under weight, under our weight. So I'm sorry, we're still lightweight, just barely, I think. Yep. All right, let's let's get out of here. Oh, actually, first we should heal ourselves. I'm going to assume that there's no time limit on getting this task done. Oh, I I think that you should probably at least be jogging everywhere to save your brother. Oops, well, this is not the elevator. We can come back here to explore these locations later to see if there's anything new which showed up. Our brother needs saving, so let's go get let's go get him. Oh, the Crimson Fort is where we're supposed to go now. Oh, I'm sorry, no, no, that is correct. Oh, you know what? We we didn't see Long Tail Village under attack. It's, it's been the Crimson Fort this entire time. Okay. When I saw the Crimson Fort earlier, I thought that was the Longtail Village under attack. No, it's it's only the fort that's been sieged. We must hit some traffic right there at the very end. Let's go. You know, some magic in this game would be cool, too. I don't know how they would do it. Maybe use cheese in the castings? But having an ability to mark a spot to teleport back to it would be handy. To avoid some of these transition screens for when you can't just walk there. Now, I didn't see the mask... As an item we equip. I'm assuming it would be a head spot. I said a head slot. Yeah, I don't see one. So I'm going to assume we, we have it. that will automatically put it on as we get close to the pipe again. I guess we'll also get to see if Jay's still alive. When I saw when I saw the captain of the guard die, I realized that oh, we might lose our brother here too. Give Reggie even more of a reason to slaughter all the all the frogs. Take a hit. Of course, we also used half the ammo for my shotgun there. Mental note, Tim. 
Oh, we get some of it. We, well, we got some of it. It looks like from that bug. We did. Sh we did fill the bug with pellets. That was an accidental shot, but you know, take it. Actually, no, that was a mistake. We never should have done that shot. I didn't realize we would shoot whatever was in front of us. I guess that makes sense for a, a shotgun-like weapon, a weapon that uses uh, pellets. Good to go. How do I how do I put it on? I'm guessing it's on. These devices appeared to give the power of flight. Reggie would have been impressed if they were not on the backs of frog scum. So they're using technology as well that we don't we don't possess. I can't say it's a very effective way to damage us though with that uh, leap attack. Nice, good job, Reggie. <laughs> Woo! Fun fight. Interesting to see the fr that the frogs are using again technology that it seems more advanced than what we possess. I'm guessing they use steam-related uh, equipment as opposed to the mole's electricity. supposed to go up there, Jay, but I see a chest down here, and our brother, well, he'll probably be okay. <laughs> Ooh, a really nice hammer. We go to medium weight, though, if I take it, but I'll, I'll take it. I'm a sucker for maces and hammers. I love them. What a great weapon. Oh, I stored it though. Okay, well, well then, well, so much for that. <laughs> oh, it's a one-handed weapon. Oh, awesome. That's even better. Okay, we place our sword with this. It's an ambush, Reggie. It always is an ambush when you when you wonder what it is. I like to self-destruct. That's nice. Something like something I have, actually do have to be careful of. If I'm feeling really overly confident and I'm too close to them, I have to remember that they can blow up after I kill them. That was not that difficult of a battle in the end. I got the impression that the mask would be something we wear instead of the crown. I'm glad it's not in the end. All right, so we're at medium weight because this hammer weighs a ton.
Do I want to stay at medium weight? I really don't want to, so we'll go back to the Gladius at the moment. Gladius, however, however I say that. Interesting, someone's been living down here. Too late. Reggie saw from the docks his brother's silhouette on a ship surrounded by tribal frog soldiers. No sign of their foul He had to get to his brother. It's a lot like the the first frog boss we had to kill. Reggie had little trust in shamans. There was more mystery in this world than his father had taught him. The shaman had gone, but he'd left a key. Wow! I can't believe we did that first try. The key dropped by Shamun. I see the shaman. Nice. It looks like it belongs to someone else. I like the look of it. We don't need that. I refuse to use frog weapons or helmets. I need it to save the game because that was a really difficult battle. Oh, interesting. We there's a little more in the flask than I ever than I think there is left over. Since apparently we can still drink for a tiny bit, even if it looks like the flask is completely empty. So that it was additional medium armor. No, I'm not wearing frog equipment. We've, got, we've, we've gone this far without using it. I, oh, I do like the... I like the look of both of these weapons. Let's stick... I guess we'll stick with the sword at the moment. It does keep us in light... Uh, light off... In fast roll. There we go. That's what I should be saying. Let's see what's in... I guess we're, this key unlocks this door. A turtle! A tortoise or something of the sort. Rather old looking. And chained. None had seen a turtle in many seasons. His father claimed he found one here as a boy. But it didn't look old. Reggie was almost two after all. 
Could a turtle reach such an old age? So he needs a paddle. Oh, yeah, the other half of what he's currently using to help canoe us. Okay, we'll find it. But first, we're going to go look at your treasure chest and take that sword. Slightly more weight than what we're currently wearing. Looks like a machete to me. Oh, he wants us... No, I'm sorry. He wants us to pull the lever over here. Grateful to be free, and promising entertaining tales of Reggie's father as a pup, the turtle offered to take them across the river to the foul froglands. I feel like we should stock up before we go there, though. But our brother is waiting, so... So I guess we're gonna go. Although, there's an exclamation mark all the way over here. Maybe we should? I'll think about what we'll do next episode, everyone. And we'll stop here, because it feels like, again, we've been playing for close to an hour. It's been a very exciting episode, too. Lots of fighting. And we, we only died, what, twice? Once? Once. I'm getting better. I'm totally letting it get to my head. <laughs> Alright, everyone. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care, everyone.